Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Chris Perillo here from chris.perillo.com, giving you an exclusive look at the Star Player app that's coming soon to the iTunes App Store. And I've already fed it my XM credentials. We've logged in. Uh, I had been on the search pane, which would allow me to search for channel name, number, description, or genre. And you'll have to pardon if this isn't completely clear for you. This particular camera does not have a, a macro lens. Uh, but let me flip back to all channels. And you can see we have uh, a list that's scrollable with the finger. There are the accompanying logos to the channel titles. Let's go to one of my favorites, 80s on 8. We tap it. We're immediately taken into uh, the album art, if there is album art. And it's buffering right now over 3G connection. So apparently no album art for this one. However, we do have lyrics. And we have an opportunity to either buy it from iTunes, Amazon, or email the channel. Let's go done. Now that's a 32K stream. 64K only works over a Wi-Fi network. Let's try 20 on 20. See if we can get album art for this one. Buffering. Yeah, unfortunately the uh, room I'm staying in right now has horrible connectivity. There you go, Kanye West. There's the lyrics. And of course the ability to buy it from iTunes, which is grayed out right now, buy from Amazon, or email the channel. I could choose to list the stations by genre as well. So there's all the pop stations, and then it looks like country, uh, Christian, jazz, and blues. Just like, you know, the regular old XM lineup. That's exactly what it is. In fact, I can flip between XM and Sirius by tapping the logo icon in the upper right-hand corner. And, uh, of course, I don't have a Sirius account, so no information there. In settings, I have the ability to edit either the Sirius or XM account, log out, reset the channel lineups, reset the channel logos. And then I can also view the libraries that are being used specifically by the app. And then there's also the legal disclaimer with GNU public license. And uh, that's about it. Um, I'm really happy with this. Considering I'm an XM subscriber and paying for this anyway, uh, I'm very happy to see that uh, this integration is coming. Uh, it works well enough. Ooh, I love this song. So there's the, uh, um, the album art pulled in there. And before the, even before the song started, the album art played. This is over, again, a 3G connection. Lyrics. And you can control the volume. It shows you the uh, channel uh, number at the bottom. And of course, you serious star player. And then I can press star. Done. So now I, I uh, essentially have made that a favorite, I believe. And as I said, this is really uh, an exclusive look at this particular app that will be available. Uh, real soon. Um, they've done an amazing job with this and certainly would take your donations uh, if you want to see further development. You'll have to pardon the uh, color casting of my hand. It's kind of turning from, you know, my normal skin color to yellow because of the odd lighting in this room, but hopefully you don't mind. Um, I'll also be posting uh, static screenshots to my corresponding blog post at chris.perillo.com uh, for this particular app. Uh, anyway, we'll see you later.